Again from Eagle Rock Loop Trail in Arkansas. Uh, I was here two weeks ago solo backpacking but this time I am back with my dog Bobo and my boyfriend Ben the Ram. <laughs> yeah I couldn't wait to show them how beautiful the trail is so we decided to go back today. Um, it's only 7 15 a.m. right now and um, since I already have all the footage from the last videos. I'm just gonna film the river crossing because I couldn't film the river crossings when I was alone. So now I can film it and I'm gonna count how many river crossing and creek crossing that we're gonna do. <laughs> okay. Bobo's so excited to be outdoor. Look, he's running. <laughs> I'm so happy for him. Second crossing. Okay. We did it. Bobo did it the fastest. <laughs> no rock needed. <laughs> no rock needed. Okay, here's four. Bobo, I was going to film you, but you're too fast. Fourth river crossing. Stream crossing. Crossing number five. Good job. <laughs> Going uphill slightly now. No wind at all. And it's about 28 degrees. So magical. This is the eighth crossing. Somebody left their hat there. Bobo? How are you gonna cross Bobo? Figure out a way. That's that's how Bobo cross. Stay out of that. And there's ice. Bubba, let's go. Uh oh. He can't do it. It's too deep. 
part of the water was too deep for Bobo, so they're going a different way. Um, this time the water level is slightly lower than the last, oh, the last time I did, two weeks ago, it was higher. Is that deep? Yeah. Oh no. Tell them to get on the rock. They're going all the way around there. I guess that's not a good option either. They're going even further. Oh no, he fell. We are at mile 6.2. Soon to be a bigger river crossing at mile 7.3. Ten creek crossings. Bo boys on an island. Why are you smelling? Yep. There's a lot less water this time. What do you think? That's a, that's a big jump right there. You're going to get wet. I think best case, we just walk in there and step over the rock. Okay. Change shoes? Yeah. All right, let's go oh change. My God. <laughs> Slowly, okay? Don't underestimate. Yeah, slippery. Very. Oh. And your oh. feet go numb. It's very slippery there. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, <shit>. <laughs> <laughs> Bobo, that's deep. Bobo, no. Okay? He doesn't know which, which oh, way. Baby. Yeah, just go. Creek crossing number 13. Around here? Yeah, there. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'll just go here. There's little rocks here. Yep. <laughs> yeah, I won't be doing that. I dare you. Oh, I hope you don't regret that. Look at Bobo. Good job. <laughs> oh, good job. <laughs> Oh, get up there, Bubba. Good job. <laughs> so we just crossed number 14th crossing on the log. Now number 15. Hmm, trying to assess the situation here. Maybe these, yeah. Be careful. Don't get wet. This is number 15, right? 15. sure if this counts but it could be deeper at other times so this is number 16 on, Baba. Baba this way I got my feet wet so Baba. I don't okay. care now mm. this is so oh. tall oh. yeah because he, no <sighs> he has four legs <laughs> another crossing I forgot what number Either 16 or 17. Mm. Well, my feet are already wet. Uh, those branches are in the way. Mile 9.2. Mm. 
1.6 approaching Albert Pike Rec Center. I'm going to stop for lunch. Yeah, it's a small crossing. I don't know what number, but I'm, I'll film it. Number 18. <laughs> number 19. Shortly right after number 19 is number 20. Water crossing number 21, mile 12.1. crossing two. What, that's not good? I'm right behind you. Oh no, <laughs> that's tough. <laughs> Okay, you survive. Water crossing number 21. I didn't get wet, but Ben got wet a little bit. <laughs> okay. Number 22. Number 23. Seven. It's not as bad as two weeks ago. I think I did, yeah. Changed to flip flop. I don't. I lost count how many number water crossing this is, but it's mile thirteen point seven. <laughs> It's knee deep. <laughs> Be careful, don't slip. Go, Bobo. Go. Go on, go. He won't go. Bobo, go. It's so cold. Why? Come on, go, go. 
Oh, it's so cold it hurts. Oh, I hope he's okay. <laughs> Bobo, good job. Oh boy. What a brave Sharpay. <laughs> Um, um, yeah, that's the trail. That is the trail. It's very little. You can jump and jump over it. Don't know what number this is. 20 something. Is it sharp? Really? Two weeks ago, this was dripping water. That one just fell. Bobo. We're approaching mile 14.8, and this is a big river crossing. The plan is to walk on the rocks. Instead of crossing there, I'm going to go all the way there. Yeah, I think your idea is good. I think you have a good idea because <laughs> two weeks ago I, I, I crossed this and that was very deep over there. I'm like dropped to my thigh. There are other hikers coming in this direction. They're talking about it. They're changing. <laughs> <laughs> He's coming. Go, Bobo. Go on, go. You waiting for me? Okay, I'll go with you, okay? I don't know if he's going to cross. Come on, Baba. Have you guys crossed any of the streams yet? It's freaking painful. Yes. Good job, buddy. <laughs> we are exactly at mile 15 now. Our goal for the day, minimum goal. 15 yay so whenever you want to stop and camp all right we found a campsite for tonight mile 15.2 there's one spot there there's one ten spot another one over there and there are logs and rocks to sit on and to eat on in our own creek yay Good day. This is the next morning and uh, it's 8.20 a.m. and we are going now. Put out the fire and this is mile 15.2. We have 11.4 miles to go today. Um, a few creek crossing but no big water crossings anymore. We got it all done yesterday so yay. It was cold last night but we stayed warm. We have good cold weather gear and I had to bring uh, a thick sleeping bag and a 20 degree quilt for Bobo. My turn I guess. <laughs> I told Ben the Ram he better enjoy the first three miles of our hike today because after that it'll turn to shite. <laughs> oh I love hiking in the morning. 
sunlight is so beautiful. It's cold. <laughs> go fast, Bobo, go fast. <laughs> we just crossed this creek just like 30 seconds ago and we have to cross it back to the other side. Yeah, rock hop, Bobo, good boy. <laughs> He's rock hopping too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Man, this could be treacherous. <laughs> it is. Oh, can you imagine falling into that? <laughs> you don't know how deep it is. God, I thought he was going to lose his footy right here. He almost did. On the, I mean, on the second time. God, Bubba. Don't that, Bubba. He's too cocky. Oh no, look at this. Oh, hang on, Bubba. Uh -uh. How deep is that? that? Bubba, uh -uh. wait. I think you need to go that way. Bubba, stop. Wait. Wait. It's slippery, watch out. Dude, you have zero patience. <laughs> no. No, this way. Drinking at the same time. Oh, baby. Okay. He's crossing and drinking. Ah, see? Mm. Another one. Crossing number 151. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Rock Sylvania. Yeah. Which is Bobo an expert of? Bobo hiked the entire 300 miles Maryland and Pennsylvania sections of the Appalachian Trail. So he likes the rocks. Oh, crossing! another one seventeen point eight <clears throat> mile eighteen and that's where I camped two weeks ago right there So rocky. Almost done with the first climb and Benderam is struggling. I still have my trail legs from the Appalachian Trail. I finished Appalachian Trail back in November. View is beautiful. You okay? You're almost there, Benderam. This is the peak right here. Now we go down. Yay. <laughs> Where is he? Oh, there he is. 19.5. <laughs> we have another crossing after the first climb. I love hiking. <laughs> <laughs> Where'd you go? So bad. Stop shaking your tail. I guess it's a good time. Bad dog. Bad dog. Where'd you go? Oh. That is not a, that's not a guilty face. You think? No. Oh. Pretending. It's all placating us. No snack. See how his tail's wagging? It's a good time for him. <laughs> I told him to go check on Ben and he went there. You made it to the second peak. You want to sit down? Yep. <laughs> Is it harder than the first one? Oh, only because my legs are more tired. Hmm. Your mouth. 
Oh. <laughs> okay, at the bottom of the climb number two is a creek crossing. Look at that dog. Who is that, Bobo? Bobo was chasing him earlier. He's going on the trail. Looks like he wants us to follow him. Are you okay? Where is he? Hi! Come here. Come! Good boy! Do you have a collar? You have a collar No, no collar. Come on. There's a river crossing Ooh. here. But it's doable. Hopping the rocks. <laughs> I'm afraid Bobo will pull me. Almost half a mile now. Another crossing. The dog's still wanting us to follow him, or he's waiting for us and hiking with us. Mm. We're almost done with the climb number three. Ben is hurting so bad that he thinks he won't be able to make it three more times. He was hurting so bad. His legs are so sore from yesterday's climb and today. And I have no soreness. Um, and I told him if he wants, he can climb back down to West Blaylock Trailhead, just a mile down, but then I can finish the hike and get the car there. But then there's no signal. I won't be able to look up direction how to get to that trailhead. So you just have to push. <sighs> Poor Ben Graham. Bobo, how you doing? <laughs> the last time he was carrying a full pack was last year, March. So yeah, it's been almost a year since he carried a full backpack. And this six, these are, uh, Six mountains are pretty gnarly. <laughs> Poor Ben. I told him he can go as slow as he as he want. Okay, we're at the top here of peak number three. <sighs> He's way back there. Fifteen more steps to the top. <laughs> Are you okay? No? <laughs> We're almost at the top of the climb number four. Ben's doing better after resting at the top of peak three. I think he just needs some rest. Uh, I think he's gonna make it. Now he's thinking about food. <laughs> like I did when I was on the AT. All I thought about was food. Hiker hunger. <laughs> yeah, I have no aches and pains, no soreness. Because I was hiking for six months straight. And then when I finished the AT in November, I keep hiking around Texas. And this is my second time here. <laughs> All right, three more miles, switch back. <laughs> Are you going to make it? <laughs> Water crossing and another one. Almost to peak number five. Ben is way behind. And Bobo is here. Hello, Bobo. <laughs> you like it? You like hiking, huh? We wait for Ben. Oh, you gonna go check Ben? You're checking? Where's Ben? It's okay, we wait. <laughs> Almost to the peak, right here. You're doing so good. At least it's pretty. <laughs> I haven't noticed. What? Well, look. <laughs> I 
just been looking at one foot in front of the other. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> that's not too bad. Oh, but you look like you just woke up. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the peak right here. There's nothing to it. Ibuprofen helps, I guess, bend the rim. Still huffing and puffing. Downhill now. Less than two miles to the car. All right, this is mile 25.5. 1.1 mile to the car. This is um, maybe last river, uh, last crossing. I'm not sure. Maybe there's one more. I don't know. But maybe the last one. And we're about to climb the sixth one. Huh? Almost to the finish line. Yeah, one more mile. And it's the worst. One mile, that's it. One mile, but 0.4 is very gnarly. And then cruising, 0.6 miles. All right, let's get gnarly out of the way. Okay. <laughs> so much rock. <sighs> Can't wait to eat town food. No, no. No, no, no. Bobo checking on Ben. Is Ben there, Bobo? He's there. <laughs> He's good. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Love you. Here's the top. <laughs> you made it. Six, six climb. You want to go on a side trail to the top? <laughs> There's a side trail you're going to. Going to a uh, Spirit Rock Vista or Eagle Rock Vista? Yeah. Point one. Not worth it. Nope. We've seen enough views from up here. Beautiful. Okay, now it's 0.6 miles to the car downhill. Yay! Me? I am a beast. That was tough, the six. <laughs> I'm not even tired. <laughs> well, remember, I hiked for six months straight. There's the car. Bobo and Benderam made it barely. Well, Benderam barely, barely made it. They made it. Let me interview a Bobo. Bobo, what do you think of it? <laughs> How about you, Benderam? I will not be doing it. <laughs> well, how about Wednesday? <laughs> you need a bit. Was it harder than you thought? It was. Mm -hmm. Much harder. Mm -hmm. After Maybe. Yesterday, when my legs were so beat down, I was worried about this day's climb. And then, yeah, but ibuprofen helped. Maybe you should have taken ibuprofen early in the morning. It's <laughs> the third. The third climb was the worst. Good job, Bubble.